It is a pretty big red flag for a restaurant when your own landlord calls the health department on you. Well, tonight's Dirty Dining has that very situation, and 13 Chief Investigator Darcy Spears now shows you why supermarket management tattled on its own tenant. Health inspectors came to 99 Ranch to address a concern called in by the market's manager. He was worried that Palm Vietnamese might have a pest infestation. Turns out he was right. Inspectors shut the restaurant down on May 30th after finding multi-generational, multi-species roaches in the kitchen. I'm Darcy Spears from Channel 13. This employee of the Little Eatery did not speak English, so we asked him to call the owner, Lou Tran, who says there's nothing to talk about. It is gonna be on TV, whether you talk or not. I just wanted to give you the chance to explain. And there's more than just roaches to explain, like a soiled rag touching uncovered sugar, an employee's soup and cell phone on a prep table, and grease and food debris buildup providing food for the roaches. Then there's this added bonus, an employee's hemorrhoid medicine stored on a shelf with food. The market had to call the health district on you. She blames the market manager, saying he was mad at her. Why would the manager be mad at you? I think they would be, a, they would be worried about about cockroaches in a supermarket. They certainly want to protect their customers. And though the health report cites her for knowingly operating under an imminent health hazard, Lou says she wasn't aware. You're saying you didn't know you had cockroaches until the day the health inspector got here, even though they found plenty of them that were easily visible, both dead and alive. Palm Vietnamese's own pest control records show roaches had been there before around the walk station. Lou told inspectors she had no recollection of that. The pest control company said she blamed their technicians, stating this is their responsibility, not hers. Palm reopened June 1st with an eight demerit A grade. There was another closure at Barbacoa Hidalguense at the Broadacres Flea Market on North Las Vegas Boulevard in Pecos. It was shut down May 26th with three imminent health hazards. When inspectors arrived, they found all the food had been prepped and customers were being served without any employee hand washing. There was also wastewater leaking onto the floor from a broken pipe. And check this out. When employees have to keep Pepto-Bismol handy, customers might want to question where they're eating. Lastly, LB Daddy's, also known as Big Daddy's Barbecue, was closed May 25th for the imminent health hazard of no hot water. They were also dumping sewage water into the street. The food truck was at Cashman Field for the Las Vegas Lights soccer game when it was shut down. It reopened May 28th with a zero demerit A grade. No one at Barbacoa Hidalguense returned my call for comment. They got their A grade back on Tuesday with zero demerits. As for LB Daddies, the owner says everything was working fine when the truck left the commissary and things only began malfunctioning when the health district happened to be there. Darcy Spears, 13 Investigates.